Tazabu argues that the absence of death would first and foremost eradicate fear. Death is often the ultimate fear, the finality that shapes our actions and decisions. Without the threat of mortality, fear would lose its hold on humanity, leading to a profound shift in our behavior and mindset. The concept of family as we know it would also disappear in a deathless world. Birth and death are the pillars that define the family structure. Without death, the cycle of life would be disrupted, making the formation of families redundant. Even the very institutions that govern our society would cease to exist. Religion, which offers solace and answers to questions about life and death, would lose its purpose in a world where death is absent. Similarly, education, driven by the urgency of our limited time on earth, would become pointless. Indeed, societal structures such as government, law and currency would lose their significance. These systems, built on the foundation of mortality, are designed to maintain order and ensure the well-being of individuals during their finite time on earth. Without death, the need for such regulations and governance would become obsolete. This extends to infrastructure and practices that sustain life, including houses, trade and agriculture. These are driven by the need to survive, a need that would become irrelevant in a deathless world. Tazabu also points out that conflicts and wars often fueled by the fear of death and competition for resources would cease. The concept of demand, a driving force for economic growth and development, would also disappear. The philosopher's perspective extends beyond the physical realm, suggesting that the virtual world, simulations, illusions and even the concept of the matrix would lose their significance. These constructs, often used as an escape from the harsh realities of life and death, would no longer be necessary. Tazabu goes even deeper, arguing that the absence of death would challenge the very notion of self. The learned self, ego, and the concept of duality would lose their relevance in a world without death. In summary, Tazabu's perspective presents a radical vision of a world without death. It suggests that the absence of death would not only change our individual lives, but would also reshape our society, institutions, and even our understanding of self. While it is a thought-provoking perspective, it ultimately serves as a reminder of the profound impact of death on our lives.